Welcome to our ghost hunting show. So I'm Toothless and I am the most important person here. And uh, this this Azure, he's just, yeah, he, he just helps me. Hi. So we're gonna be looking for ghosts because we are. And um, we think that they live here. So we're gonna look for them. Um, we're gonna wait to do it at night because that's what ghosts like. So, uh, yeah. We're gonna go and turn on all the lights now because ghosts don't like lights on either, so. Yeah. Just turn that off. Doesn't do much. Get this off. It's getting darker. It's almost night. Okay, um, it's pretty much night now. Uh, it's night. So, the only light we're getting is from our flashlights. And so, I don't know, I can really be using those because it's kind of hard to see. So, we're gonna be turning on our nighttime cameras soon, so things will be a little bit black and white, but that's okay. Okay, so the black and white camera is on, and we have discovered something. This house, though it is uninhabited by any other dragons, does have something that seems to be nesting inside. It is a cat. I don't know why there is a cat here, because this house is supposed to be abandoned. I did the research, it is abandoned. Just as a cat for some reason, so. We do not know if it is aggressive or wild or feral, so we're gonna leave it. Whatever lived here last had a very spooky sense of good decoration. This shelf has like a fake skull on it, and I don't know why it's here. And there's a cage with a creepy fake bird in it, and there's like a kind of glowing skull, and it's really freaking us out. Right now we're in the darkest room. We're in the darkest room in the entire house. And um, it's the bathroom. And it's kind of scary. But um, we're gonna pull through. Still looking, we have not found anything paranormal yet. Repeat, nothing paranormal yet. Do you think we're gonna find anything toothless that's not ordinary? Yes, we will. It's just a haunted house, of course. So, let's tell our viewers a little ghost fact. So, ghosts are still on this earth because they have unfinished business. A good example of this would be like they didn't finish eating the box of donuts they had. That's actually a horrible example. A good example is, you know, maybe they have a lost loved one they need to say goodbye to. Don't tell me what I know or don't know. I am very educated in ghosts. You've only been studying them a week. I studied them for five years. That's just him in his sense of humor. Actually, it's not. That's just his sense of humor. Ignore that. Yeah, ignore that. Just just ignore that. It does not matter. It's Azure. Why don't you go look for sounds? Azure? I said go. Bye, Azure. Okay, so, um, nothing is happening at all. It's kind of boring. I might go to another room. Okay. Something not boring just happened. This door just opened. And um, it wasn't open a second ago. And I'm scared and I'm gonna close it. Azure, where are you? Let's go to the next room. I agree with that. Okay, okay, get back to the cameras. Come on. Okay. Okay. Toothless is emotionally scarred. But um, we did make it out of the bathroom alive. Um, Yeah, he should not be this scared because... He has studied ghosts, and he should not be scared, and he's a trained ghost hunter, but, uh, here he is. Don't make fun of me, you never actually found a real ghost. You haven't? Neither have you, this is our first day on the job! Uh, oh, okay, 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 I'm sorry. Have you had any experiences with them in your, um, individual life? In my individual life? The only experience I've had with ghosts or paranormal things is you. Why me? Because your eyes are so big, it's not right. But that's not paranormal exactly. It is to me. Anyway, um, we're just gonna uh, keep looking at... There was a noise. Let's go explore! Oh my god. <laughs> okay, um, he does not know that you were supposed to, you know, uh, cut the recording before you do that. But, um, it's kind of too late for that. So, okay. Okay, Toothless, what is it? I think it is this can. It has been moved. It was not here before. By the way, why is it gigantic? That's not a question for me. That's a question for, like, the person who built this house. Okay, uh, let's, uh, let's go. But for me! So, basically, um, we're gonna leave this camera up recording. So, 
it can get stuff well you know walk away and keep looking so uh if anything interesting happens which it probably won't we do have a backup camera we're bringing with us so uh, yeah let's let's go come on to this okay we'll just leave it Uh, we didn't leave it like this, did we? No, we didn't. I made sure it was standing. What the heck? Our camera was knocked over. You must look at the footage. No, no, we, we don't do that in the um, in the middle of an investigation like this. We should look at it. No, no, Toothless. No, we need to wait. You're no fun. I actually know how to do this. Okay, okay I'm not even gonna argue. Let's just go. Okay, okay we are back in the living room. Yeah, um, we're just kind of waiting for something to happen. We're not finding, well, we're not finding anything. Kind of sad. Did you hear that? I'm hearing some creaking. Okay, Azure, for a moment, be quiet. Just for one second, not to sound. Stay calm, stay calm. Okay, um, what do we do? Oh, um, we're just gonna go look on the stairs, if there's anything there. Oh, we'll, we'll just film while we go. Okay, let's go. Okay, we're on the stairs. We're seeing if the noise that we make on it sounds at all like what we heard, and it does. So, just kinda hearing right there, kinda makes some sound, so. I'm thinking it might have been the stairs. Could have been something on the stairs. I'm not sure what, but it's not really that. It's, it's scary. Okay, um, let's go down here. Maybe, um, we should probably uh, go investigate some more. Uh, well, okay, I think we should leave some like a camera or so up. Okay, we'll leave some cameras up. Then. Yeah, but then we'll just go back and check how they do. Okay, time to go put up our main camera. See what we can capture. Okay, so we left the cameras recording. We left them recording for uh, maybe an hour. I don't know, it was a while. We were investigating, didn't find that much. Um, we heard a little bit of creaking noises, but uh, after a while we found out it was just the wild cat that seems to live here. So, um... We did not. We're not gonna show those, unfortunately, on screen. Just cause, I mean, they just weren't really that ghostly, and they're not that interesting. I am hearing a little bit of creaks now. Um, I think it's just the cat, cause it kind of makes it sound as possible. I'm gonna guess it's the cat and hope for the best. All right, Tifa? Yeah. There's the cat again. Yeah, it's a little creepy, honestly. Okay, uh, what next? Where should we set up something? That cat's making sounds. It's scaring me. It's scaring me too. Oh, it's useless. Stay together. Oh my god. What is it doing? I don't know what the cat's doing. How should I know what it's doing? Wait. to cut the investigation here. I was gonna say, let's go and get the last part of the investigation done. You just trying to smack your face or something? That's not gonna get you anywhere, man. Eh, what is that cat doing? I don't know if it's a cat, but I'm thinking we should go to another room, because, I mean, should we try to get the ghost of Elmer? I know it's the cat, because I can see it. Okay. 
is okay. You know, I'm not even gonna argue. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So it took us a little longer to get back on screen because Toothless grabbed the camera the wrong way. That's what the moaning was at the end. Cause he got scared cause he almost broke it. I'm sorry. No excuses. So, because it was almost broken, it took longer than expected. But um, we're back now, and it's probably not gonna be anything for the audience, at least. So yeah, um, we're gonna wrap the investigation soon. Don't panic, Toothless. I don't want it to be wrapped up. We haven't found any solid evidence. We don't even know that. We haven't looked through like all of the, you know, uh, stuff. What do you call it? Uh, do you know any technical terms? Yes, I do! Um, uh, are you okay, Azure? I broke it. I broke the Azure! <sighs> I don't remember what it's called. Uh, the footage? Thank you for the assistance. You know, Azure, you don't know what you're doing here, so I'm just gonna. No, 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 wait, wait, I'm gonna push you back. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh, he's pushing this aside. Hi. Anyway, um. Yeah, so we're gonna get close to wrapping it up. Um, but that uh, doesn't mean in the end we still have to go through the footage, footage I said, that we got. And um, yeah, we are just gonna see how that goes. And then um, we'll do our editing and then wrap up scene. Uh, and by editing, I just mean like they're gonna edit parts of the footage because, you know, we don't want your viewers to get bored. So uh, yeah. Um, we will be back shortly. It'll probably be like, I don't know, like three seconds for the viewers, but uh, for us, it's probably gonna be more like, a, you know, eight hours. Yeah, by that time, it'll probably be earlier in the morning. Anyway, bow. Hello! We are back on our little set thing with a bunch of pumpkins. And so as you can probably see, um, the color's back now because uh, we don't have our midnight cameras on. Yeah, because the daylight is here. Well. Not that much daylight because we're in a studio. But anyway, um, well, technically we're still in the house, but it's the day. And we have a setup, so it's kind of like a studio. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna continue. So, um, we found some really creepy footage. Um, we have one piece of footage that we're gonna save for the wrap up scene because we're mean. Well, actually, because we just want you to watch the whole thing. Anyway, um, it's where we actually find what we believe to be a real ghost. Spooky, yeah. We're gonna play that for you right now. Do you guys make that sound? So, um, just in case you did not hear in that footage that we just showed, we do believe it is something saying help. So, um, if you do not hear it, we play it again in slow motion. Do you guys make that sound? Okay, you know, if, if you still won't hear it now after all that, we're just gonna uh, let it be that way, yeah. So, I hate to say it because I do love this, but it is now the sad time. The wrap-up scene is going to come. <laughs> to us, play yourself together. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um, he's not emotionally prepared for the ending of our first episode, so um, let me just turn this off now. Okay, okay. Andrew, you're doing it wrong. There's no wrong way to turn off the camera. <laughs> Now, it is time for the sad and depressing wrap-up scene. Mm, I don't want this to happen either, but um, Toothless is I'm not prepared either. Toothless, pull yourself together. We have people watching us. <gasps> okay, hello, I love people watching me. <laughs> that sounds creepy, whatever. I don't want to be stalked, but I like being watched on TV. Okay, so we're gonna show you now that thing that you've all been waiting for. The footage of the ghost that was caught on our cameras. Here we go. It's gonna be scary. 
Please never use that voice again. Okay. So, the ghost. The completely real ghost. Well, I mean, the audience judges themselves. Whether it's real or not, it's kind of their decision. Whatever, we think it's real. Because, I mean, it seems very in the realm of possibility. You know, this house really seems to be haunted. It has so much history and origins of it being haunted. There's so much evidence to support it that- <gasps> 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 We're doing an error! <gasps> 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 <gasps>